everybody it's Julie and on this video I've edited it and I'm going to show you how I made this tag. I hope you enjoy it. Enjoy. Is, I already have it set up um, and I am making a western Julie netting tag. So um, well, while I've got the pencil out I just have it's just a Crayola brown pencil that I got when the school supplies were out and I'm just gonna go ahead and do her hair okay um, oh she didn't finish cutting so I don't have a die for this one so I've been fussy cutting them Okay, we'll just cut her out. There we go. Now her skirt is some of this duct tape that was packaging on a, a swap that came to me. And so I just cut, I stamped it and then cut out. Um, I attached the lace to her skirt for her boots, I went ahead and they're actually kind of chunky. Um, let's see, we'll find another one of her to show you. They're not, well, they're, they're chunky. Her boots are chunky. And I cut them at a point to make them look like cowboy boots and then I also cut them up against because they kind of had more of that ug look. They come out a little bit, so I, I streamlined them in. So um, here I, I have the envelope ready for the for the swap. Um, it, we don't have, don't have partners yet, but I thought, well, I'll just get all these done. So I, I wanted to use one of these. I made this little rope out of twine, and I thought it would be kind of fun to put it in her hand here. I had this fell out of um, its packaging and it fell out of the thing when I was doing something over here but I thought I would use it here and I figured this little spot right here if I turned it a little her head would be would block it and I thought that that would look a little more um, little more Western and then I I uh, cut the word Western and the definition out of my little dictionary the one other thing that I did was I cut some sorry about that I cut up some cardboard so I took the top off the cardboard and then I ripped it and I, what I did, I wanted to make a fence. So I thought I would make, you know, one of those fences that has like, has like the post and the post. And then I think this is too thick, so I think we'll go ahead. And yes, I'm ripping. And hopefully this is long enough or I'll be ripping again. Well, we could put one of the posts right up against the side. Like that. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm using my Aileen's today because it's drying faster. We are really humid. And so if that helps, <laughs> then I'm all for it. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead. And this one, I want it to be a little bit over. So 
of there. And, um, oh, and I use this material, this paper here um, kind of reminded me of a bandana without it being actual bandana material. Okay, so we're just going to hold that down for a couple seconds there. Where is she going to be? Because I think we'll just go ahead and cut it behind where she's going to be. Okay. Okay, so we'll go from this edge over. We'll hold it down. edge we used to have a fence like this my grandma had a fence like this down at the beach when I was a kid and it was just for the alleyway and then when I got married married Tom and moved here he had a fence like this and when we put the cement in we took the fence down and we don't have it anymore. And I miss it because it reminded me of Granny's house at the beach. My, um, my grandma had a house, my grandma and grandpa. My dad grew up at a house um, on the beach, literally on the beach. There's pictures of Ventura when there was only nine like nine houses down by the beach now there's hundreds and hundreds probably thousands okay so I'm gonna put that I'm gonna move it so that hopefully her head will be behind that <laughs> be in front of be behind be in front of that little spot right there. And she still needs a shirt. I forgot I didn't didn't do that. It's been very frustrating with the internet being um, being like it is. So I'm lucky to get one video uploaded. It takes hours. Um, the upload, the download speed was so low and the upload speed was not even registering. Let me check, make sure that we're on. Okay. We're going to go ahead and put a little dot here and try and make this round. It keeps wanting to, to ball up. Since it's doing that, normally I would just put it on here, but I'm going to go ahead and attach it because it has a mind of its own. So I've given her her little rope that she's going to hold. <laughs> she's going to hold a little rope. Okay. Then we'll go to... I've already put a hole, so I'm going to just turn it over and cut through with my crocodile and grab an eyelet I hope this one fits we have a red star that'll be So she needs a shirt. So to get her a shirt, well, first I'm gonna have to find her. 
some material. And what I have going on is right now I have one of them on each of them on one side because I had them out. So um, okay. So we need to find her a shirt. And if I hadn't used this behind, I would have used that as her shirt. And the other doll, I already have a bunch of, a whole bunch of things are already cut out for her to wear. As I stamped that catalog a whole bunch. Okay, I'm going to try this. I like to do things that you've probably noticed a little different. Does not lose that Western. Do not want to lose the Western. Okay, so I have this. And I'm going to go ahead and take her off for a minute. So I want to see if I can get this to where she has the red collar. Nope, it's too, can't, can't do it. Okay, so she might have, okay, sorry about that, it's not going to work at all. very western. Um, I have some, right here I have some um, six by six paper pads. I like them because they have the designs and I'll usually have them smaller. So there's that. That one might work really well. There's green. Ew. This is warm and cozy paper pad. Jim Hadfield, homemade. It's got wood and deer, wood, brown. Okay, I like that. There we go. We'll go with that one. So this is like hunting and outdoors is the, the theme there. And we'll use this. And we have the stamp pad right here. We really just need to get her um, the shirt, but we need to remember that her hand comes all the way down here. So I think we'll go ahead and go there. Okay. Then we have to fussy cut her, um, just the shirt. Now we're going to just fussy cut the shirt out. Now some of the Julie Nutting stamps um, have dies that go with them. But that's really fun. It's like you're making your own paper doll. You can dress them up however you want to, to match whatever you want to. And I know that there are a couple of Western Julie Nutting dolls that actually have their their clothes and everything are already Western, but I don't have that, and so I make do with 
with the one that I do have the ones and I bought the planner set because I like them for tags I thought that they would be it would be good so I'm just cutting now I gotta cut here because I've already cut the skirt out of the blue denim duct tape <laughs> and then we're going to go here and cut out there we go so this is her shirt and it does look pretty western Now, I don't have a cowboy hat that will fit her, I don't think. I'm going to look, because I do have a stamp that is a little boy cowboy. And I've been pretty lucky, because some of these things are fitting on these dolls that I wouldn't have expected. The other thing I was going to do is make some kind of a belt. Um, so, let's go to... I'm in my stamp drawers. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They were my not three, six, seven, eight. Um, they were my dad's. They were my dad's. Um, Looks like it'll be a little too big. Hmm. But I can try. What color is that? Yes, the, so these stamp drawers were my, they, well, they, first they were my grandfather's. He was a surveyor. And then they were my dad's. He was a draftsman. And, um, now they're mine. So I've just taken his head and <laughs> I have gone ahead and inked it up. And we'll just stamp him down. Yeah, it's way too big. If it was over on the side, like... Could, might be able to get away. You know what I might be able to do? Ha ha ha. Might be able to use it. Might not. Yes, so the, um, the stamp drawers. So when my dad redid his his office when he moved his office home he gave me his map drawers and they became my stamp drawers and they are older than me and at one point they disintegrated the the um the main the part that the main part that holds the drawers just disintegrated and um, it's really a bummer okay so what I'm thinking I can do is fold it over see if we can get it small enough the thing about a hat cowboy hat is it's natural to have a bit of a, a fold look in it okay if her head was that big it would have been perfect now she's going to look like she's got a 10 gallon hat on <laughs> Ooh, 
if we put it behind her hair. Cut it so that you see her hair. You know what? Hey, you know what? I sound like a little kid. You know what? You know what? Okay, so we'll just cut the this part off, and we'll put that so it needs to open a little bit more, just a little. Go ahead and some glue okay so there's her top where's our little guy I need to look at him goes up so um, so we'll cut a little bit off like that his hair off this side. Okay, so we have both sides. So there's our little hat. And then maybe make our little band. Concentrating. Can't talk and concentrate at the same time. I can't find my my good scissors. I would. Um, I was using them in the other in the kitchen, so they're they're in there somewhere. On the table, probably. Both pair. We could put a, a star and make her be a sheriff deputy, but I think we'll leave her just like she is. And, um, okay, so she's got her shirt. She's got her boots. We were going to make her a belt. Um, I think we're going to do that with some bling. Ooh, didn't I have some? Add some silver. Could just give her, you know what, that's what we're going to do. We're going to give her, I guess we don't want to give her a fence for, <laughs> for, for a belt. We'll cut her some of this. I was thinking about doing, um, you know, one of those that is the silver, silver, like silver medallion type belt, but she's so tiny, I don't think you'd even be able to tell 
what it was. So we'll do even this, she's tinier than this. We'll do this. This with a bling. And that will be her belt. Okay, too big. She's so tiny. See if I can color it with the pencil so it's brown. I'm gonna bunch it up. Okay. So there is what I have. And I don't think I have like any any words. Oh, I do. Look at there, I almost forgot. We'll do. I'm going to take the string off this tag. Put this on here. Like that. We're going to add glue to the definition. So I did have an idea a little bit of an idea what I was doing here but as you can see some of it I I still was in the planning stage so okay so last thing is we have some more of this raffia We might as well use it because it's right here on the desk kind of looks like hey might have too much trying to go through that hole but there we go we gotta there we go make the loop And pull it through. And there you go. We have our. You know what? I I'm gonna do. Well, we got two problems. We got some stuff here. Got it. And. my good size star there it is so really old I think it's Marvy or something like that I think, oh Carl it says Carl okay. and try this first
just like that one. There we go. Then we'll just add that one. And the rest of it. Too much. Okay. So there we have our little Western Julie Netting paper doll. And uh, again, I didn't have a cowboy hat, so I built one. I didn't have cowboy boots, so I made them. We made a fence, added lace, used duct tape that was denim duct tape here to make the skirt, added a little rope. We have the definition of Western out of a little dictionary, added an eyelet, and some raffia. So I hope she enjoys this. I hope you enjoyed this vi video for What You Make in Wednesday. And tomorrow we should be back to normal with our um, regular video scheduling um, as long as they're able to fix everything tomorrow. So hopefully they will. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments, questions, suggestions, something you'd like to see, put it down below. Don't forget to join my Facebook group, Scrap All About It, to, uh, for more ideas and to be able to share um, your ideas and things that you've done with maybe some of the ideas that I've shared. And yes, so thank you so much. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.